Welcome back to our video. Today we are reacting to SML movie, uh, Jeffy and Junior's Big Heist. So, you might see a change here. I only have one pop filter. It has been very hard to cope with only one pop filter. But it is needed so that my, you guys can see my whole face and that it is not obstructed because that pop filter was too huge all right it was too huge it was too big i i yeah it was too big and you need to just do this like every single time and it like it was, it was bad so now i'm not on a double pop filter day um i'm now on one pop filter and also if you want to uh if you want this more th of this quality content right here please consider subscribing liking the video hitting that bell and checking out the description down below because there are so many links in the description that you need to check out so please check uh, stay ruining my 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 intro so please check out those things the description subscribe like the video that bell if you want more quality content like this so in three two one let's react oh man oh man oh man charlie and friends is on it's my favorite show ever charlie and friends it's a return i'm pretty sure you haven't seen charlie and friends since this is the first charlie and friends video in 2020 i'm pretty sure i am pretty sure but i don't i don't i don't, I don't know I don't know. Charlie and Friends was filmed in front of a live audience. <laughs> Hi guys, I'm, I'm Charlie. Charlie. Cheer for the crowd. Like and today I'm home alone. You know what that means? I'm a play with myself. <laughs> Gotta get ready. What? Oh, Vino lotion. Really oh, need that. Play with myself so hard. All right. Now what game do I want to play actually, by myself? Super Mario Logan actually has an arcade machine. I mean, today like every single YouTuber has an arcade machine. It's like like every single YouTuber has an arcade machine. Like every single like gaming YouTuber that I've seen has an arcade machine. I'm pretty sure Dan TDM has one and uh Ninja has one, I think. Yeah, I mean, Ninja definitely has one. There's no way that Ninja doesn't have one. But, like, this is the first time that I've seen a non-gaming YouTuber have an arcade machine. Um, I'm pretty sure I have seen other non-arcade... Actually, David Dobrik, right? He has an arcade machine. I mean, he has, like, a $16 million mansion. So, I would think, like, an arcade machine would be one of his priorities for that mansion. But, alrighty then. Oh, Miss Pac-Man! Oh, look at me, playing with myself! By myself! <laughs> oh, oh, Charlie, I thought you were talking about something else! I wouldn't mind watching that either! <laughs> How do you come up with this stuff? Oh, genius! Comedic genius! Hey, all you Charlie and Friends fans out there, do I have a contest for you? Who wants a side pair of my underwear? Yes, yes! Who wants a side pair of someone's underwear? I mean, even if they're a celebrity, who wants, like, a side pair of some celebrity's underwear? I mean, I'm pretty sure, like, some celebrities have actually sold their underwear, but I, I don't know. Who wants a side piece of their, un of, who wants a side piece of a celebrity's underwear? I don't know, maybe those people out there that really love these celebrities and they need their underwear to show that they are a big, 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 big fan of this celebrity. Oh, I've been dreaming for this day, yes! And not just any pair of my underwear. Hold on. Alrighty oh, then. Oh, yes. oh. Very fresh. This pair. I've had these on since the very first episode of Charlie and Friends. Yeah, that's disgusting. That's that's 
We don't want to give them out to your fans. It's, it's just disgusting. No one wants to, to sign up for a contest like that, you know? Oh, and I haven't watched them. God. And they can belong to you! Yes! Charlie! I need those! Give them to me, please! And you're probably wondering, <clears throat> how do I win these? So bad. Well, all you have to do is call me and tell me how much you love me. And if I believe you, you win. I'll be waiting by my phone. That's all I gotta do? Now, I've seen people like celebrities and YouTubers giving out their phone numbers. So, I took advantage and got my phone and got, like, these three, like, y y celebrities phone numbers i didn't call them because they're international and it would cost a lot of money but I, I i i can't tell people that i have a celebrity's phone number one is like jesser the other one is marshmallow and the other one is jake paul so i have these three people's um uh these three people's phone numbers and i, I don't know what to do with them i yeah, I've set up everything. I've set up like their birthdays, their like their addresses, um, their everything, almost everything. So I don't have a way to call them or text them, but I can just say they have a f famous person's uh phone number. Oh, 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 I can tell you how much I love you. I love you every day. Where's my phone? Where's my phone? Oh, 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 I can call. Oh, oh. I'm getting a phone call. Hello. This is Camille Habib Habab, and I want to put your underwear on my doorknobs. Well, how much do you love me? Oh, uh, as much as a camel loves water? Uh, not good enough. Uh, bye. Not good enough. God. Next caller. Right. Um, what? Come on, come on. Answer me. Oh, I'm getting another phone call. What? <coughs> uh, hello? Hi, this is Mr. Goodman, and I would Mr. like to Goodman. buy your underwear. Uh, they're not for sale. How much do you love me? I don't love anyone. I only love my money, so I would like to buy your underwear. Ooh. Well, they're not for sale. Uh, Alrighty. Next then. caller. Stop answering other people. Answer me. Another caller. Hopefully this one loves me. Hello? Please tell me you love me. <laughs> Charlie, it's me. I love you so much. I love you. I love you. I, I would do anything for you. I would put my kid up for adoption for you. I, I would eat my own toenails. Oh, I what? I put my kid up for adoption for you. I'll eat my own toenails. The second one's disgusting. The first one is just why. Whoa! It sounds like that fan loves me. <laughs> Looks like we have our winner, guys. Congratulations, Bauer. <laughs> you get the underwear. Oh my. Oh, probably yes! don't want that. I want the underwear! Oh man, about to cook dinner. Chef BB, I want the underwear! What? I want the underwear! Oh, Ow, Bowser! Oh, I want the underwear! Oh, I need to get a new job. Hey, Junior, I only got four fingers. Watch out with that. I want the underwear! You want underwear? Yes! Is that a good thing? Yes! Pee -pee. Yes. Exactly, pee pee in the underwear. Pee -pee. I want the underwear. Wow. That must be the underwear. <laughs> Hello, do you have my underwear? Congratulations, you're the winner of Charlie's used underoos. Uh, hey, I'm the only one that can smell now. <laughs> Everybody in the kitchen right now. Oh, what, Bowser? What do you want, Dad? You see these beautiful pair of underwear right here, signed by Charlie? Ew, Dad, why do you have that? Because I want them in the contest! And I want to hang them up right here, in the kitchen, so every time I eat, I can see them. Ew, Dad, why would you want that? Because they're special to me! He's a very, very big fan of Charlie. That's probably why. Look, look, you better not touch them, okay? If you touch them, oh, you're gonna lose all your video games and toys for the rest of your life. And Chef PP, if thing. you touch them, you're gonna clean the toilet with your tongue. You got that? Oh my. Hey, I understand, Dad. Oh, whatever, Bowser. Uh, what your dad want, Junior? All he right. wanted to tell me not to touch his smelly underwear that's hanging up in the kitchen. Why would you do that? I don't know why you do that. Hey, Junior, you want to have a food fight in the kitchen? <gasps> I've never had a food fight before. Yeah, let's have a food oh, fight. No. PP. Junior, Jesse, your dinner's ready. Oh man, perfect.
perfect timing. Now we can have our food fight. And it's ravioli, so it's really messy. Ew, there's green beans on it. I hate green beans, Junior. But I'll start the food fight. Food fight! Yeah! <laughs> Oh no. oh no, I'm in so much trouble. Those are some dirty underwear, Junior. They need to learn how to use the bathroom. Jeffy, do you know what you just did? I sent it hard. No, you threw ravioli all over my dad's side you underwear. Did send it. Why does your dad got dirty underwear all over the wall? Junior, what did you do? Well, I didn't do it, Chef Pee Jeffy did it. Well, he wanted to have a food fight. Well, oh, you know what? I'm just gonna tell your daddy you're going to get grounded. <gasps> Let me go and untie me right now! No, you're gonna tell my dad get me grounded! But today he's gonna find out anyway! Untie me! Oh, well, then I'll let you out when he finds out. How about that? No, no, no! Junior, untie oh, me! My. Untie me! Uh, close it, Jeffy. Untie me right now! Uh, <laughs> Alright, so we'll get him out whenever we have fixed underwear, okay? Uh. Okay, now that we got rid of Chef Pee, Pee, we have to find a way to fix this underwear before my dad sees. Well, why don't we just put it in the washing machine? That washes clothes. You're a genius, Jeffy! And it also what? washes the signature, right? I'm pretty sure it also washes your signature. Ink with my head and not with my butt. All right, let's put them in the washing machine. Oh. All right, Jeffy, I think it's done being clean. <laughs> Wait, where they at? Okay, they're there. Oh, look, they're good as new. Pee pee. Now all we have to do is hang them back on the wall, and my dad will never notice. She Junior, when something goes bad, there's always a good. Yeah, let's go. If yeah. something goes bad, there's always a good. I, yeah, there's no signature now. They look perfect. My dad will never notice. We did it. We did it. Yay. Yay. We did it. We did, we did, it. did it. No we did eating it. here we tonight. Did no it. eating here tonight. Wait. No we eating here tonight. We're we gonna die. Jeffy, Jeffy. I know we did it. Uh, uh. Jeffy, uh, uh. Jeffy, we did it. We, we didn't do it, Jeffy. What? Look, the signature's gone. Oh, well, it must have just ran away. Well, no, my dad cared about the signature. It was signed yeah. by Charlie. <laughs> because if there's no signature, it's just a piece of underwear. You don't have proof that it's the actual Charlie from Charlie and Francis' four-year-old underwear. You don't know it. He's my most favorite person ever. Well, why don't we just get another signature? Because he's super famous. I, I don't know how to get another signature from him. We just go to his house. I mean, that seems to be what people like to do these days. We'll just... Yeah, because everyone's address is leaked. Every famous person's address is leaked. Every YouTuber, every person that is that you can call famous is house address is leaked. Like Face Rugs, his address is leaked. Um, there's a lot of people's address that is that has been leaked out there on YouTube. Yeah, like Jake Paul. Jake Paul, too. A lot of people. Show up at his house and get his signature. Well, uh, okay, we'll, just, yeah, we'll do that. We'll, we'll Google his address and show up to his house and he'll sign it. Okay, let's go. Let's do it. <laughs> okay, Jeffy. Google says that Charlie lives at this address. I don't think I'll have any problem with us just randomly showing up. Yeah, me either. All so right. we're going to go up there, ask him to sign this underwear, this and we'll be good. Okay, be and I'm also going to ask him for some free stuff. Yeah, let's do it. Oh, man, Jeffy. Right. I'm so nervous. I don't know what to say to him. Jeffy? Jeffy? What? I said I'm so nervous, I don't know what to say to him. What? Take the Sharpie out of your ear. What? I said I'm so nervous, I don't know what to say to him. Oh, I'm going to ask him if I can live with him. That's a good idea. Okay, so how, how should I knock? Idea. Oh, I'll show you. Please, open up! Hold on, I'm coming, I'm coming. Oh, hello. I'm Charlie. <laughs> Why aren't you cheering? Oh, oh, oh. There's always an audience. Yeah. What are you guys doing in my house? Can I live with you? Uh, we were wondering if you could uh, sign a pair of your underwear. What? A pair of my underwear? What are you doing with that? Well, I mean, we won in a contest. <laughs> Get them here. They're mine. We, we, we need you to sign those. Oh, no way. Get off my property before I call the cops. <laughs> Who's laughing? What? Oh, my. Very rude person there. Very rude. Hey! You can't take those! You should be in the top five rudest celebrities. Or... What what you can what what Charlie is like in real life, and it's like a picture of him, uh, swearing to a little kid. And it's always those clickbait thumbnails and titles. Yeah, like I have saw one like Sunday, like swearing to a little kid, or like I mean that wasn't true. So that should be on a top top five celebrities are rude or. 
Char what is Charlie like in real life? All right. We need those back! What am I gonna do, Junior? Well, now we have to get a pair of his underwear. Um, oh, I got an idea. Come on, Jeffy. All right. All right, Jeffy, are you ready? Why am I dressed like a girl if I got a winner? Because, Jeffy, we're a married couple. Our car just broke down, and you really have to use the bathroom. So we're gonna knock on the door. We're gonna say that you have to use the bathroom. You're a girl. He's not gonna say no to you. So while you're using the bathroom, you're gonna grab a pair of his underwear while I distract him, okay? But I got a winner. It doesn't matter. He doesn't know that. So knock on the door she like a girl. Doesn't know All right. that. Oh, hi. <laughs> I'm Charlie. Ooh. What are you guys doing right. here? Uh, hello, sir. Uh, me and my beautiful wife, Jeffina, uh, were driving through your neighborhood, and our car broke down. So she really has to use the bathroom. So we're wondering if you could use the bathroom. Yeah, but I got a wiener. I don't know how that works, but sure, you can use my bathroom. I don't know how that works, but sure, you can use my bathroom. All right. All right, let, let's go, Jeffrino. Good. So the bathroom's over there. Okay, thanks. I mean, ooh, I'm a girl. You got a nice place here. Oh, thank you. So right. how did you meet your wife? Second grade. Oh, man. I dropped out in second grade. <laughs> how do you get those people to laugh whenever you want? Oh, those are my friends. Hmm. They're probably locked in the basement because everyone's locked in the basement. So those people that are laughing everywhere that Charlie goes are probably in his basement. Just saying. Trapped and kidnapped in his basement. Yep, those are underwear. So I got a question. Your name's Charlie. Why is there three Y's in your name? Well, there's a Y for every divorce I got. Because I wonder, why did I even get married? Is that my underwear? Uh, uh, Jeffy, run! Ah! Give me my underwear! Hey! Oh, oh man, Jeffy, that was close! Well, at least we got the underwear. Well, now all we gotta do is get him to sign it. But how? I got an idea. Come on, Jeffy. All right, Jeffy. We're dressed as TV executives, and we're gonna say that we're from corporate, TV. and we're gonna pitch him a new TV show idea. Right. He's gonna want the deal so bad, he's gonna be begging to sign that underwear, thinking it's the contract. Junior, I'm business up top and party down below. Yeah, if I saw us, I would sign a TV deal. Me too. All right, knock on the door. Uh, oh, this is a business deal. Open up. It's a business Hold on. deal. Uh, hi guys. Hi Charlie. <laughs> Everyone cheering. Who are you guys? We're right. from corporate, and we see your name in light. Hollywood signs. We see you being famous, kid. We want to pitch you a TV show. Wait, I'm already famous. But you could be more famous, er, er. Just, just let us inside, and we'll tell you how to get rich. More famous, er, er. I like that. Come on inside. Yeah. Great idea. So what were you talking Great. about? So you have a hit TV show named Charlie and Friends, right? <laughs> yes, I do. Well, how would you like to be rich? <laughs> Tell me more. Okay, so we were thinking about a new TV show called Charlie and Friends 2. Wait, 2? Number 2 in your pants. In my pants? In yeah. your pants. Yeah, Charlie and Friends. Charlie and Friends number 2 in his pants. What a great TV show. People should have thought of that uh, before because it is going to be a hit TV show called Charlie and Friends number two in his pants. Great TV show. Two, actually, Charlie and Friends Dose. Dose? Yeah, Dose. it's going to air on Telemundo. Right. Telemundo? Yup, see, here's the thing. People in America love Charlie and Friends, mm -hmm. but people in Mexico don't know what you're talking about because people the show is in Mexico. English. Ay, ay, ay. Yeah, so if we make Charlie and Friends Dose, it's going to be Charlie and Friends in Spanish, and all the people in Mexico will love you. We're talking international, baby. We're yeah, talking and if you throw a couple of chip poppies, chip poppies, You'll be good. Yeah, I'm talking no more U.S. dollar. I'm talking full-on pesos. Oh, I like pesos and Mexican women. There, there you go. So it's and a win-win. I'm talking all the Mexican pesos. And look, do you want to sign or not? Yeah, where do I sign? You sign here on a pair of your underwear. Man, these contracts are getting weird. Yeah, you, yep. So just sign your name, uh, like kind of like an autograph on this underwear. Okay. Kind of sideways. Yeah, yeah, like that. Well, it was a pleasure doing business with you, Charlie. Or should I call you El Charlo? Gracias. El Charlo. Uh, I'll go wash it. All right. Okay. Uh, finally, Jeffy. They look exactly how they're supposed to look. We did it! We I mean, they got a... So, this, the recap is... Uh, Bowser won a contest that's 
Charlie's underwear that hasn't been washed for four years, and then they put ravioli on it, and then they washed it, and then they also got another pair of Charlie's underwear, and got Charlie's signature on it. So, a very, very, that's a roller coaster right there. That's, that's an example of a roller coaster. We did it! Yay! Yay! No we did it! Here tonight. We did it! No we did here it! Tonight. We did it! We did it! What are your breath doing in my underwear? Oh, I'll tell you, sure. We accidentally threw ravioli at your stinky underwear. Oh, no, 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 no. Jeffy, shut up. Let's go. Yeah, you better stay away from my underwear. Oh, oh Charlie, I love these underwear. Uh, today was stressful, Jeffy. You said it, Junior. A very I just have this weird day. feeling that we're forgetting something. Oh, yeah. Four fingers, Junior. No, I don't think it's that. It's something else. You don't have any fingers, Junior. You got a club. Junior, you forgot oh, about shit. me! Junior, get me out of this trunk oh. right now! Junior! Junior! Well, he's dead. What is your favorite TV show? I mean, if you call Netflix a TV show, then there's a lot of, like, Stranger Things or Lucifer. And Umbrella Academy is one. I don't know. It's a very... I would say... Stranger Things, or maybe it's Lucifer, maybe Stranger Things. Stranger Things has ha is only up, but Lucifer has had its up and down, so I would say Stranger Things. Alright, if you count Netflix as a TV show, uh, like a TV thing, then I would say Stranger Things. So yeah guys, thanks for watching, and of course, we'll back. Peace. Peace.